Hey there, this is a Ziggs counter video intended to fill you in on everything you need to know to deal with Ziggs when he's on the opposite team. If there's a champion you find yourself struggling with in your solo queue games and you're tired of banning it, then feel free to drop a comment and let us know. If you're interested in learning more about Ziggs or any other champion, then head on over to the Mobiletics website where you can see everything you need to know including builds, combos, pro builds, tips and more. So first off, what does Ziggs do? Ziggs is an artillery mage who focuses on poking and harassing down his opponents until they can finish him off with the final bomb. Ziggs has insane area of effect damage making him a great team fighter. Ziggs is great at sieging with his teammates and can destroy structures with ease due to his passive and W. Let's hone in on Ziggs strengths and weaknesses. Ziggs's main strength is his poke and harass with his kit making him a huge lane bully. He has amazing AoE damage with his ultimate as it is semi global this allows him to influence other lanes easily. He excels at taking down structures while poking and sieging and can wave clear in an instant. Onto his weaknesses, Ziggs struggles against assassins as he doesn't have any reliable way to deal with them. All of Ziggs abilities are skill shots allowing his enemies a chance to outplay him. He has no form of escape when his W is on cooldown. We're going to dive in specifically how to counter Ziggs but first is an overview of the major tips that we'll be breaking down further in this video. First avoid his Q. Ziggs main form of damage and poke comes from his Q. Try to avoid playing too close to your minions as he can harass you while he's farming. Remember you have more time to react to this the further away you are. Trade around his passive. Ziggs's passive empowers his auto attack. Don't try to trade with him when this is up and instead wait for him to waste it on a minion while farming. Punish his W cooldown. Ziggs's only form of escape is his W. If he uses this aggressively, make sure you punish him for it, especially if his flash is already on cooldown. Be careful when diving into him. Ziggs's kit has a ton of tools to destroy champions who dive in on him in team fights. He can do a huge amount of damage with his minefield and ultimate, so be careful when diving in to kill him. Don't leave him to destroy your structures. Ziggs's passive and W both help him shred down those towers. Be sure to punish him when he overextends to take them down. It's always good to think about when a champion is strongest or weakest. Ziggs is strongest in the late game where he has a ton of AP items making his ability deal insane damage. By this point he will have the defensive items he needs to keep him alive and has got through his somewhat underwhelming early mid game. Ziggs is weakest in the early game due to the fact he has a ton of bad matchups and he's extremely easy to punish. He also doesn't deal a significant amount of damage until he has lots of points at his abilities. Let's take a look at his early game. At this point Ziggs won't deal a crazy amount of damage but he will be able to poke and harass you down if you let him. Make sure to dodge those Qs and only trade when Ziggs' passive is down. Make sure to punish Ziggs when his W cooldown is unavailable as you will really struggle to escape without it. Don't let him push you under the turret as this will allow him to poke you down and dive you with his teammates. He will also deal significant damage to your turret and give him bonus gold via plates. Remember when playing aggressive in other areas of the map that Ziggs can easily take you out with his semi-global ultimate so always have that in mind. For the mid game, Ziggs will be ramping up and starting to deal good damage, especially in team fights. Try to catch him out before a team fight as he will often overextend when sieging. Try to keep track of Ziggs' flash. He is very vulnerable without it and if he uses his W aggressively he is a sitting duck. Capitalize on this by getting a jump on him when he can't escape. Don't stack up. It's common in the mid game to group and go around together looking for picks of vision or when taking down an objective, but remember when against Ziggs, be careful not to group up in confined spaces as this will allow him to deal a significant amount of AoE damage. Avoid the epicenter of his ultimate. In the early mid game, Ziggs's ult needs to hit you in the center for it to really deal damage. Try to avoid sitting in the middle as it will seriously hurt. For the late game, this is where Ziggs really starts to shine. He will have a ton of damage and also defensive items to keep him alive. His abilities will seriously hurt at this point so always be aware of where he is and don't let him catch you out with his burst. Be careful not to chase him into his minefield. Ziggs works well on the back foot as you can litter the floor with abilities as you look to chase him. Be mindful of this late game as these abilities will melt you. Don't get baited by his Zonyas as he can deal huge AoE damage to you just before going into the stasis. Focus him. Simple, right? Well, Ziggs is an AP carry and a late game monster. He will be your priority late game, so make sure you and your allies are focusing on shutting him down as otherwise you will just destroy your whole team. Let's take a look at some of the items you can build against Ziggs. Sustain in lane. An early Vampire Acceptor or a Corrupting Potion could definitely help you out when laning against Ziggs annoying harass. Banshee's Veil at Edge of Night. These items are fantastic against Ziggs as the spell shield can easily prevent a huge chunk of damage from him or potentially the knockback from his W. Heavy Magic Resist. Ziggs deals a ton of damage, especially in the late game, so make sure you're building some Magic Resist against him. Look at the Iron Solari. A great pickup for supports to bring down Ziggs' AoE damage with a Clutch Shield. 
That wraps everything up for a Ziggs counter video. If you enjoyed this video, then you can find more counter videos on our website or in the playlist link below. And be sure to subscribe to be alerted for when we cover a new champion. Thanks for watching and we look forward to seeing you again.